My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We have an absolutely stunning 1957 Pontiac Star Chief. Star Chief was top of the line, their flagship model, and this thing is restored wonderfully. I mean, this is an exceptional car. Beautiful colors, air conditioning was just added, along with the factory power steering and power brakes that it already has, makes a great driver. Go to volocars.com, you can look at all the pictures, read the information. You'll find a price tag on this car and every car that we have for sale, along with a monthly finance payment as well. Go to volocars.com. Hope you enjoy the video. Subscribe, click on the bell icon. You'll be notified when the next one's posted. Right now, let's go for a spin. <clears throat> Okay, so I'll be honest with you, we owned this car a year or two years ago. A lot of my customers, they like to tinker with them and get something different. That's exactly what happened here. Gentleman I sold it to happened to own a body shop, so he knows a good car. Uh, he really enjoyed the car. He made some nice upgrades. Uh, he put radial white wall tires, so those are new. He painted the roof blue. It used to be white. And wow, that really made the car pop. And he added air conditioning to the car. So three big improvements. Underneath this car, rock solid. The floors, the rockers, braces, all rock solid metal. A real clean, thin coat of undercoating underneath, nice and black. This uh, suspension, chassis components, all of that is clean. It's all painted black. It's all nice and clean. Uh, Correct exhaust, it's a single exhaust, but the correct type, correct muffler. You look up at the motor, you can lick the oil pan. Looking up at the motor is spotless. It has the correct oil filter with the stickers on it, the starter, the oil pan, it's just immaculate. It has the four speed automatic, I think Pontiac was calling it the hydromatic at that time. Uh, so super clean underside. Fit and finish on the body is outstanding. This thing's absolutely straight. Uh, when I use the word exceptional, I want you to know this, is, this isn't just a good looking car. This is the car that would uh, satisfy a fussy person. Uh, but anyway, absolutely straight, big long hood, gaps are square, no issues, no dents, no damage. This is all right on the money, all clean metal, smooth, all nice and smooth and clean. All nice, look at the gap. See the little gutter trim that opens, closes when you close the door. But you know how I love the door that closes like that. Hardly any effort at all, just click. That's nice. The roof is straight, no issues. There's no issues on this body at all. I mean, it's, it's like it's new. I don't see an issue at all. A lot of the 55, 57 Chevys, they're all the same. The paint gets chipped here. There's a nice gap there, but if you slam it too hard, it comes down and hits. Must have chipped the paint and it's been touched up with a brush. But the trunk fits like it's supposed to. Uh, excellent, no rust, no damage, no issues. So again, the body, excellent. The paint, the two-tone uh, ivory and blue is beautiful. It's smooth, it's shiny. Um, I'm sure there's an imperfection here or there, but I'm telling you, it's at least as nice as it would have been when it was new. Uh, the last time we sold it, it just had this blue and, and on the wheels, but again, the roof, that, that really uh, pops. And I'm sure if you took it to a shop, that'd be every bit of $1,000 or $1,500. So that's been done for you. Uh, the trim on the car. Got these nice rockets on top of the fenders. They look like new. This is, I'm gonna call it show quality chrome because again, it's exceptional. All of this is just sparkling, gleaming. The Pontiac logo here, all this stuff is just brilliant straight chrome. Has the deluxe mirrors, a pair of them and one on each side. The cowl, I don't know if it would have been chrome originally, but it looks really nice in chrome. Even the base of the wiper arm, usually those are pitted. 
That's uh, beautiful chrome. All this stainless trim. Looks like it's all been straightened and polished. All this stuff polished out like chrome. Has the fingernail guard behind the handle. All this looks like new. The moldings down the side look like new. There's the four stars that designates the star chief. Back here, look at all these chrome. Look at the big tail lights and bumper. All this, again, show quality. In my opinion, it's all sparkling. Here's the fuel filler right here, part of the trim. Again, this is all straight, not beat up. Excellent shape. Uh, the rear glass is really clear, a couple of light scratches. The rim is painted the same color blue, has the uh, uh, tri bar uh, hubcaps in really nice shape. And again, the radial white walls were installed within the last year. The windshield uh, has a stone chip in the windshield right here. I believe it's the original windshield. Has a New York inspection sticker. That's who we sold it to. He was in New York. My previous ad said it had a Virginia sticker from 1961. He must have peeled that off. Uh, but anyway, that's the outside. It's, I'm going to give it a 9 out of a 10. No problem. Let's open it up to show you the inside. All right, let's see what the inside of this big old trunk looks like. Neat and tidy. All painted nice. Oh, yeah, it's got this retractable light. I love these. This unwinds. It should go all the way to the front of the car. Uh, and then you just wind it back up. Now, you leave your comments. Don't you agree with me that every car should have one of these? I believe it turns on when you pull the headlight switch on. But what a great idea. So anyway, neat and tidy. The weather strip is real nice. The whole trunk compartment, nice, clean, solid metal. It's got the proper trunk mat. It fits in there real nicely. A painted rim. This is a reproduction white wall, never been used. Has the nubs on it for a spare. We got the complete jack assembly. Even the spring is still here that holds it in place. Uh, we've got some extra parts here that he must have accumulated. Here's some stock uh, basic hubcaps. Now it has the spinner caps. Uh, under dash speaker. So that will go with it, of course. Nice, nice trunk, complete and clean. Now I'm telling you, this is one of the good ones. This car is exceptional. It would cost easy hundred grand plus uh, to make a car this nice. Door panels are beautiful. It's got lots of chrome and the two-tone and the knobs and handles and armrests. All that is excellent. The metal trim on top of the doors looks original. There's a few scratches and nicks in that part of it. The dash area is beautiful, nice and clean. Is missing, looks like one knob here on the lever. But all this trim, look how it's not beat up. It is 45,000 miles, absolutely believed to be original. Uh, this is all polished across here. Glove box is clean. You got the owner's manual. Here's the air conditioning unit. That'll blow ice cubes on your lap. Now look at the carpet. It's the tight weave correct carpet. Look at the power on the gas pedal, brakes. Just that trim alone is cool. Steering wheel's beautiful. I, I just, I love it. I love cars from this area when they're this nice. Seats have all been rebuilt. They're nice, firm cushion. We got white seat belts front and back, so they're all reupholstered. This is leather right here. This is soft, genuine leather on the seat. Uh, everything back here is in excellent shape. The carpet, the seats, the side panels, even the rear deck has the correct speaker grill. We got working uh, lights and the headliner. It is the top of the line, so it has the chrome ribs. The headliner and visors are excellent. It has an old Pontiac mirror, and it has the daytime, nighttime mirror. And who can tell me what this is? I don't know if I should tell you or if we should leave it in the comments. I think I'll leave it in the comments. And then obviously this clock is just stuck on there. Uh, it's not even working right now. It needs a battery. But this other deal, that is a factory optional piece. 
Yeah, so what we have is a 45,000 mile clean, rust-free car that someone uh, gave it a restoration, but I'm sure it was a really good car to begin with. This is not a resurrected car, I can tell you that. Okay, the motor. Oh boy, I think it's a 370, I think was the size of the motor. It's a, a V8. Uh, looks like a four barrel under the big old air cleaner and everything is stock, the generator, the air cleaner. But this here is the new air conditioning that was just added. It has Pontiac valve covers, nice clean firewall. Up front, He's added an extra electric fan to, to keep the motor running cool with the air on. They have an overflow tube for the radiator. And then it has the stock fan on the engine with the shroud. Battery is secured properly. This has power steering and power brakes. Looks like the fuel pump is new. Hood insulation under the hood. This is a nice car. I've said it before, if we were to close our doors tomorrow and I could keep 10 cars, this would be in the top five. I, I just love this car. I love this era, the colors and the quality. It's got it going on. Someone's gonna get a really nice car. Uh, there you have it. it. Has my thumbs up, both thumbs up. Go to volocars.com. The salesman can help answer your questions. Uh, they'll help get this delivered to your door. They'll help you finance it at volocars.com. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon. You'll be notified when the new ones are posted. Thanks for watching.